Wow, this looks amazing. Thanks. Yeah, you know, I feel like most people want to spend their first date at some fancy restaurant, you know, and it's like, why would you spend all that money when I can just make the same thing for cheaper? Yeah, yeah. maybe you should open your own restaurant or something. It's actually funny you say that. I have been thinking about that pretty seriously, actually. But why don't you be the judge? Why don't you take a bite? Tell me what you think. Mm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Kind of taste that sesame mm -hmm. flavor going yeah, on. That's, that's really good. Yeah. So, uh, listen, I feel like obviously we should get to know each other and stuff, but why don't we just like skip through all that bullshit small talk that always happens on first dates? Okay, yeah. Uh, well, I live pretty close to here. I just got my undergrad. I'm living with my parents for this um, summer. Um, listen, Chloe, that, uh, that's, that's boring stuff. Let's, let's get right to the okay. meat. I want to know, I don't want to know what you do, okay? I want to know who you are. Do you, does that kind of make sense? Okay. So, for instance, uh, why don't you just kind of... What's your first impression of me? Well, um, I'm grateful for you having me over and cooking me dinner. But honestly, the food's not that good. Oh, okay. That's, that's good to know. It's, it's fine. I can handle it, obviously. Just kind of blindsided me there. What? Here, why don't I go next? Um, sure. That shirt you're wearing, it's... It's not nice at all, actually. What's wrong with my shirt? The color's kind of off, you know? It doesn't really flatter your body, and it doesn't really give like, off a good impression. I'm sorry, is everything all right? Yeah, I mean, we're just being honest, right? Yeah, but maybe this isn't such a good idea. You seem pretty bothered. Well, I mean, I guess I just don't agree with what you said about the food. And I don't agree with your comment about my shirt. Do you know how long it took me to make all this? And I said I was grateful. You no, know, it's interesting how you talk about wanting to be authentic and then start the date off by lying. I was just being polite. I don't know what you want from me. So what? You don't think I can open up a restaurant? Huh? You don't think I have what it takes? Do you want an actual honest answer? Yes. Okay. Then no. <laughs> of course. What? You're just like the rest of them. What do you mean? You're just like the rest of them, Chloe. You're making a big assumption based off of very little. What else am I supposed to go off of? You had one bite, one single bite, and from that bite you made a huge claim saying that not only am I a bad cook, but that I'm unfit to open up a restaurant. If you're a bad cook, then you are unfit to open up a restaurant. Actually, that's not true, okay? You can still open up a restaurant and have better cooks do it for you, which is kind of besides the hey, point. Hey, so you want me to take another bite, do you? Yeah, please. Mmm, mmm. You know what? I was wrong. This is so good. Mmm. It was a second bite. But you should open up a restaurant. Mm. It's just so good. Mm. Just divine. Wow, that was uh, so graceful. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that ever. Is that how you act on most of your dates? With so much grace? Fuck you. I can't believe this is actually how you treat people. I mean, seriously. Do you want to know my real first impression of you? Gee, this guy's obviously a lot shorter and uglier than he is on his Tinder profile. You're just some narcissistic prick who should never be allowed to date anyone. Chloe. What? I'm just fucking with you.